Now, the Philippines has also signaled that it may withdraw from the ICC, and that comes on the back of Russia's announcement, which is essentially symbolic. Moscow says the ICC is one-sided and biased. Julia Lyubova has more. Russia signed the treaty in 2000, but has never ratified it and therefore isn't subject to ICC's jurisdiction anyway. Moscow's move to withdraw from the treaty is really symbolic. The Kremlin spokesman uh, said the decision to withdraw Russia's signature from the treaty is in Russia's national interest. On Monday, the ICC's prosecutor's um, office issued a report, and in this report it's, it said that Russia's annexation uh, of Crimea from Ukraine in 2014 uh, amounted to international armed conflict conflict and also said uh, that the situation in Crimea is now occupation. Well, this has angered Moscow, uh, which says that the report contradicts its uh, position and contradicts its reality. And Moscow's position is that uh, Crimea uh, joined uh, uh, Russia in the referendum. Well, Moscow has previously criticized the court rule for rulings against Russia uh, with the, in the 2008 conflict with Georgia. And also now Russia comes under um, pressure of its uh, military conflict in Syria with several Western leaders saying that that could amount to war crimes. Well, now Russia joins several African countries which have uh, recently said that they are quitting uh, the ICC. Burundi, Gambia and South Africa have all accused the court of bias. Julia Lyubova, CCTV, Moscow.